at my channel or welcome if you are new and welcome back to another Walmart grocery haul target delivery order and make sure you stay tuned because I'm going to be sharing with you the best air fried chicken wing recipe. It's actually random but it's so good so make sure you stay for that and let's go ahead and jump right into the video. So not only is this wing recipe delicious, it's actually super easy. I just got the frozen pack of wings from Walmart and I let them thaw out. Then I used some random HelloFresh packages that I had laying around that I wasn't using for anything. I filled up this bag with olive oil and I shook it around. Then I add the spices and then I shook it around. And let me tell you, it was so good. I put it in the fridge for about an hour and after that, it was ready to go. And just so you know you're not a bad mom, we made brownies first, and that's my leftover lunches. So there you go. Brownies and leftover lunch still out on the counter. So I am going to make my own ranch this night. I'm going to use milk, and that's one cup of milk, one cup of mayo, and also just the ranch packet. And you can use the Hidden Valley one or the Walmart one. Either way, I just like to put it in the little shaker. It tastes so much more like restaurant style, and I love it. Once all the ingredients are in, just shake it up and let it chill in the fridge for about 30 minutes. We also had pizza this night. It was a super easy night because we had so many leftovers from the weekend, so we just decided to make something super quick and super easy. But what you wanna do with these air fried wings is put them all in on a single layer. Make sure none of them are on top of each other. You're gonna cook them each at about 360, 10 minutes per side, so about 10 minutes through, you wanna come in and flip them over. Once you're done with that 20 minutes, you're gonna come in and you're gonna change the temperature to 390, cook it another six minutes to get that crispy golden brown color, and they will be perfect. And then of course, don't forget to put your pizza in. So here's some of the leftover marinade from the wings. Of course, I'm gonna save that. And then here is what the wings look like when they're almost done, right before I flip them and get them ready to get extra crispy. But of course, you can use any kind of seasoning you like. I just like this method of cooking. All right, there's Piper, of course, she's in every video. There's some new Zodiac Dreamer stuff over there, but here is our little summertime haul. I feel like every haul is gonna be like this the entire summer, but we got some milk. We actually have another order coming from Target later. It's a shipped delivery order because they did not have stoked cold brew, they did not have Uncrustables, and those are just staples in our house. Let me know down below what are staples in your house. Also, let's make that the emoji for this video. If there's a stable emoji, I don't know if there is. If there's not, let's use the pin drop emoji. Let's just use something pokey, <laughs> okay? Anyway, this caramel macchiato creamer, I actually am not a fan of it, but this was a substitute. I actually wanted the vanilla caramel and they only charged me $1.84 for this and I know it's like $5, so. Aubrey said she would drink it, so I accepted it. If she wasn't gonna drink it, I wasn't gonna accept it because honestly, I don't like it that much. We also got the Real Gourmet Cream of Coconut for our pina coladas, the best pina coladas in the world. Pineapple juice, of course, for the pina coladas. We also got some strawberry flavored water in the cans. And then we got two cans of tomato sauce and we got some Rotel. I have a couple recipes I'm gonna use that for this week. We got some bananas, bagels, hot dog buns, white bread this is also a substitute we just got the half loaf but they gave us this entire classic white loaf also if you're sleeping on these stop sleeping on these these are so so stinking good they're like the chicken pot pies but they're sausage and gravy and they're so delicious bun size franks also got some hazelnut spread of course for ansley she loves 
her Nutella and this brand's cheaper, let's be honest. Also, Old Orchard Pineapple Juice, frozen juice, and I've actually never had this frozen stuff. I think my mom used to get it back in the day, but I've never personally bought it myself, so I'm gonna try that for a recipe, and then I have a really fun recipe in mind for this, so stay tuned. I don't think I'm gonna share it in this video, maybe another video. Also grab some bacon, just because we like to have this on hand. I already have bacon in my refrigerator from Butcher Box, but I wanted to get some more. I got some Italian sausage. I also ordered some sausage from Target too, but they had this mild ground Italian sausage. I've never had this kind from Walmart. I always buy the kind in the roll. And then I also got some more sharp cheddar cheese sticks for Alex to munch on. And then these, of course, we always get these little Alfredo packs. This is just to have. Literally, if there's one of those nights where we just don't feel like cooking anything or we just want something really quick, yes. And this just says try them with hot dogs instead of ground beef. What? Let me know if you've done that. I've never seen that on the box, but. Now I have three new things in this haul. I have this key lime pie Kit Kat, which I'm excited to try. I know a lot of you have already tried it. This new cheddar garlic biscuit mix, which I'm really excited to try. I always get the one that is in the Bisquick brand, I think is what it is. And it is a yellow package, but I figured I would try the Pillsbury. Pretty sure I already told you I got these fruit and grain bars. Maybe I didn't, but Aubrey loves these. Aubrey and Alex also love Cocoa Pebbles, so I grabbed those. Grab some more cotton candy flavored grape juice. Really, Piper? Really? I can't. I got this variety pack. They changed up their variety packs at Walmart, which is really cool because Alex likes those, so I got those. And then I got these. These are also new blueberry crisp cookies. I saw them in one of my hauls in the past and I didn't get them and you guys were like, you have to try them, you have to try them. So grabbed them. Got some mashed potatoes for Ansley. She loves these little mashed potatoes she can put in the microwave. For chips this week, we got crunchy Cheetos and Funyuns. And let's see what else. Just manwich. This is just a half on hand. We got some more of these because we were out. And y'all, my girls go through shampoo like it's the end of the world, like the toilet paper shortage. So I got this 88 cent shampoo. I got one conditioner, two shampoos, and they're just gonna have to use the 88 cent shampoo because I'm telling you, I'm not buying a new big bottle of expensive shampoo every week. You feel me? In just a few minutes, the Target order should arrive and then I'll show you what we got in that order too. It's only like a $36 order actually. So it'll be pretty small. I just got my Tario order in. I'm a little sad. They did not have any Stoke Cold Brew coffee and I don't even know how much I have left. I'm about to check. Okay, that feels like pretty much almost a whole thing. So this should last me at least through like Tuesday. I'm not a huge coffee drinker, um, like you probably think I am. Okay, so after all that, the shopper even told me they were out of the unsweet black stuck cold brew. Look what we have. I didn't even open the packages because I just, or the bags because I believed her. So maybe she found it and she didn't tell me. But anyway, I got these Uncrustables for Ansley because Walmart was out of them. This was also the other item Walmart was out of today. Oh, they were also out of these, but they tried to substitute them for the other one and the girls just like the shells and cheese ones. So we got those. And then Aubrey wanted some of this squeezed applesauce. I don't think I've ever bought this before, but I, she probably had it at my sister's house or something. So we got that. And then I got these everything bagel or everything crackers, not everything bagel, but everything crackers, never had those. I needed some more mozzarella and cheddar. Oops, I meant to get sharp cheddar, but it's okay. Got some more sausage and strawberries because we forgot to get strawberries at Walmart. So that's my little bitty Target haul. Thank goodness I have coffee. Okay, I'm gonna try to sit down and get some stuff done. We are leaving for the beach next week, so y'all know the week before the beach is just always so crazy. I did get these new skincares in. I'm really excited about this. Let me know if you have dry skin or if you have like medium skin or if you have oily skin. I have really dry skin. And I've heard that gel cream is actually better for oily skin, but I have dry skin and I enjoy the gel a lot more. 
And then this is like the overnight mask I use. This is by Saturday Skin. They actually sent it to me. I love it. But I was just wondering about that, about your skin, because I love any kind of water gel moisturizer. And this is it by Saturday Skin. So good. All right, thank you guys so much for watching another Walmart grocery haul, Target haul, all of the things. I even added a little recipe in this one, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.